Region 18 forecast, News 18, weather from where you live. Well, just expect more of the same kind of a broken record when it comes to the weather forecast. There is literally no change in our forecast. Temperatures back up into the mid 70s this morning with those dew points up there close to 70. So very saturated, very tropical out there. And that's just going to continue. The winds have shifted out of the east now at six miles an hour as that pesky low pressure system slowly chugs along across the area. So it'll be sticking around for another 24 hours. Temperatures across the area. We are in the upper six to the mid 70s. So very warm and humid as you head out the door and you can see where we are. Everybody in the upper 60s and here's the graph here. Muggy is between 70 and 74, but we are in that humid category. It still feels very muggy out there with these temperatures and this tropical air mass in place. Radar is showing you all the activity this morning is down to the south and that's where it has been for last evening, the last 24 hours, that's where we've seen much of the precipitation. Some heavy showers and thunderstorms around Indianapolis and south of I-70. That's continuing. A little bit's creeping up into Montgomery County there. Some scattered showers and a couple heavier pockets there as well. The bulk of the precipitation, as I said, has been around the Ohio Valley down through the Tennessee Valley. It's all associated with the same storm system. In fact, southern Indiana had some reports of funnel clouds last night. We're not expecting anything severe in our area, but we are looking at some heavy downpours. When they do pop up, they linger and that can give you some heavy rain, locally heavy rain. So anywhere from up to two inches an hour. So that's one thing we do have to watch out for, but anticipating rainfall amounts, you can see a variety here and not a whole lot as that rain continues to stay to the south of us. The bulk of that heavy rain will be passing to our south. So certainly some good news for us. We're not looking at uh, any major flood concerns. Uh, you can see highs today. We are back up there. Yesterday's high officially in Lafayette, 92 degrees. We were the hot spot. Everybody else stayed in the 80s, so we're going to be back up there today. Precision cast is showing you that we do have that precipitation down to the south. Very widely scattered again. Some shower activity through the morning hours and then maybe a couple isolated thunderstorms popping up through tonight and tomorrow, but we will be clearing out for Friday and the weekend, but we do have a hot air mass that will be coming into the area triple digit index. We have to watch for that as we get into the 90s Friday, Saturday and Sunday. We may be drier. The system's going to move out, but now we have to be concerned about the heat index. They could approach the triple digits, so we'll have to watch and see if we'll have any heat advisories posted by the National Weather Service. So we'll get rid of the rain and the uh, muggy conditions, but it's going to be hot over the weekend.